Okay, this is my latest toy. It's a data plotter. Uh, right, well, this is the gubbins under the bonnet, so to speak. You've got the motor at the left hand end there, and the motor controller, and you've got a, a voltage regulator. Uh, I've had some trouble with voltage regulation. There is actually a voltage regulator in the motor controller, which was using, I was using to power some of the circuitry. But the pickaxe kept cutting out whenever the servo operated, and I thought I was losing, not having enough power for everything, so I put extra voltage sources in. Anyway, there's the battery. And this is the, uh, the, the, the pickaxe chip, 28X2, which has got lots of extra pins and lots of extra memory although I'm still running a bit short. I put a little buzzer in there so that it can go bleep when uh, when it comes to the end of a run. And the motor controls on this side, and the it's a Nemo 17. And the really interesting bit from my point of view is, is this. This is the uh, control board with the, uh, a series of menus on it, which I can control by turning that knob, setup menu, data menu, drawing menu and within each menu there are various actions and I can select using this button here so uh, for instance I can make the pen go up and down this is the pen arrangement made out of uh, perspex and there's of course the inevitable servo there which allows me to raise and lower the pen like that We set it moving and see how it works here at the end of the chain. It goes over a little sprocket that I've made and obviously there's counterweights on the other side. And then there's a counterweight on the other end, like that. Now it's not entirely working yet but I can give you a little demonstration so you can see how it works. We're on the manual menu here. Let me go to the setup menu now, and uh, when I select that, there are various options. I can change the paper size, so let's choose a nice big picture. We'll do A A2. Should we go to a big portrait size? Um, I can also set up the menu by changing the scale, so we'll make it nice and big, shall we? So we'll go to change scale to three times the normal size. And then the last thing I've got to do is, before I start, I have to align the pen so that the computer knows where everything is. Please align the pen and centre it on the page. So that's what I shall do now. Aligning the pen means getting it central on the paper, like this, as a starting point. And uh, I can do it on a little dot on the paper there. Or I can look at little colour markers on the chain here, which also show me where the central point is. And then I think we're ready to uh, to start the run. The paper is now aligned, and it's set the resolution at five millimeters, which is rather coarse. But there are various problems getting high resolution on this because the pickaxe chip doesn't uh, doesn't do the maths for high resolution, which is one of the problems I've been having. Now right, it sets off down to the origin. And there it is at the bottom of the page, all ready to start the first run. And then I'm going to select Draw Test Card. Test Card is a little image that I've loaded onto the chip for experimenting. Let's see what Can you tell what it is yet? And there you have it.